Well, Expose, we're off globe trotting again, and here we are in the film studios in Alicante in Spain on the set of Colin Farrell's latest movie, Triage, in which he stars as a photojournalist. It's co directed in Spain and moving to Ireland in the next week, but we here in Expose flew to Spain to check it all out with the cast and crew. Lisa Cannon here from TV3 in Ireland. Hi. Congratulations to Alan and all the crew for doing such a fantastic job. We haven't seen it yet. But uh, Colin, obviously you play a photojournalist very much similar to what these lads are doing to you. Um, did you have to do a lot of research to do the movie and uh, was it different being on the other side of the lens? That is, in effect, what I play as a reporter who tells the news through the capturing of the, the still image. Uh, and he's been at it for about 12 years and uh, we meet him in the beginning of the tale at a particular time in his life when he's, uh, it's taking its toll. Great. No, it's just that you're on the different, you're on a different side, you know, yeah, behind just, the camera, yeah, like what yeah, we yeah, do. Yeah, no, it's great. I mean, it, it was, you know, it's it, it offers up incredible amounts of material, um, and is an incredible, well, not backdrop. It's very much in the foreground of what he does and who he is, uh, and just a well of kind of thoughts and ideas and experience to draw from as an actor, you know, trying to portray the character, and I think it. I think that same well is drawn from, if I can speak for the other actors, by everyone involved in, in the cast, are those that are directly linked to my character, Mark, and, and Jamie uh, Sive's character, Jamie Sive's character, David, who's my friend. Uh, you know, the wives who are at home as well, when the guys go away, and, uh, and how they deal with the return of their men. And so, I mean, it was just an incredibly rich subject to be able to tackle, you know. Colin, who had come straight from set and still in costume, is three quarters way through shooting the film. The movie moves location to Dublin next week, and although it's a strong psychological thriller about the inevitability of war, it has left much speculation about his dramatic weight loss for the role. Colin, you've lost an awful lot of weight. Well, it's just been well publicised, and I just obviously I've seen you in the flesh, so, you know, I know you've been doing it through Doctors. This is obviously to portray the character, yeah, for more. Rather than explain the process of his weight loss, Colin read from the movie script so that we can understand why the character looks so gaunt. With his coffee, he went to the bathroom to shave. Once the weak old beard was gone, he saw that his face had become drawn. He pressed at the hollows beneath his eyes, the pronounced knobs of his cheekbones. Production of Triage moves to Dublin next week, so expect lots of Colin Farrell sightings. And now Lisa joins me in studio to give us all the real gossip. Lisa, that was a bit of a whirlwind tour, wasn't whirlwind. it? Whirlwind. Over and back to Spain and one day I was on the red eye in Erling yesterday morning and then back again. Woo! So I'm here with you now to tell the tale. But um, it was it was really overcast over there and it was glorious sunshine here in Dublin. So it was very disappointing. And he's actually coming you. here, isn't he, on yeah. location to, next to film week. the rest of the movie. But we That's couldn't right. wait. We had to go to Spain. We had to go to Spain to get the exclusive. And of course, we were the only Irish crew there, so it was great. And everyone was in Spanish. There was a Spanish translator. But I I think he really appreciated the fact that we came over because we're huge supporters of the Irish film industry for Expose. So, you know, we do make the effort to go and find out some new material that's that's been shot in different locations. So it was great. He looked really, I mean, obviously has lost so much weight Dramatic for that role. Response. How much weight has he I lost? think I, approximately I heard rumours about three stone. Wow. So two to three stone. Um, just all three I mean, doctors. He's still then. so devilishly handsome. I mean, there's no <laughs> yeah. doubt about it. But it doesn't suit him at all. He looks wow. tired. This is older. And he, he, I mean, he lo I think he just come off the set. I mean, he was wearing his costume. He was wearing his wedding ring he's married to Paz in the movie who's his wife Elena and uh, he plays Mark a photojournalist so literally as I saw him coming off the set straight into the press call and I wondered was he still in character or was he, he still in the mode yeah he yeah. wasn't as kind of up and kind of up for it and cheery and kind of the jokey Colin Farrell that we're used to meeting he was very demure and very relaxed I wondered you know was it something he felt he, he wanted to, to get across about the weight loss because he came prepared yes. he had that book and I was yeah. obviously the only English journalist so I asked the the que each English speaking journalist rather asked the questions so um, he had, was ready he was on form and he, and he, and he per, you know, performed he so just seemed really kind of down maybe he just needs to be fed <laughs> maybe he's just a little bit hungry come, come on Colin come home we'll fast feed we'll, feed you. You. we'll feed you well they're all coming back it's meant to be a brilliant movie and it's, it's Irish based which is brilliant it's all produced by Parallel Films Alan Maloney so well done wow. and uh, yeah so. not a big budget one for Colin no, this time round it's nice because I really feel he's such a great actor I think he's so brilliant and uh, he seems to have lost a in a couple of roles over the years, but this yeah. time now with In Bruges and with Triage, hopefully yes. people would 
begin to see what an extraordinary actor he really is. Well, that's it, and we're dying to see it because his last couple of movies have been brilliant. Because we'll be I have home. shown his acting. He's going to be dad. home now, girls. Great. So. Okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll be there. We we'll let you know where he is, girls. Don't you worry. Exactly. Thank you so much Thank for that. Thank you. Take care.